to give yourself a section of the bar. Feel free to give yourself a bar. Uh, we did this format last week and the week before, but it was all four. Still haven't really come up with a name for this format. It's very interchangeable. Uh, this is more upper body, more arms and core. Uh, trying to save some legs for tomorrow's festivities. How this workout goes is you're going to start off with a massive lap and when you come in, we're going to have these doors. That's going to be the out and that's going to be the in because there's going to be a lot of coming in and out. Uh, and so we'll mark it off and, and remind you. Uh, these are going to be the reps for every round. You've got three rounds on this first uh, set. You've got four movements. So you are going to do 10 of all four of these movements. Then you're going to do one hill. Then you're going to do 20 of all of these movements, oh. then two hills, 30 of all those movements, three hills. You're going to jog around down here, 25 hours, and then you're going to yeah. uh, start on the other side. Whenever you come in, when you, whenever you get done with your burpee, two box jumps, you're going to start with the hills. <clears throat> okay? And then you're going to do your movements. So you're going to do three hills, 30 of all these. Two hills, 20 of all these, one hill, 10 of all these. Then you're going to polish it off with a dirty 33rd for your finisher. Uh, uh, any questions on how it's right now? All right, so these movements look like this squat jacks. You're going to have one of your dumbbells. You're going to have it up underneath your chin, nice and tight to your body. You're going to squat deep and then bring your feet together, pressing that weight overhead. No shallow squats today, guys. I don't want to see the ju jumping jacks with a weight in your hand. I want to see squat, nice deep squat jacks. Planking rows is going to be with your uh, dumbbells as well. Nice wide base, keeping that body straight. Keeping those hips square to the ground and you're going to row in. This is going to be total, uh, not each side. So uh, there's going to be five on each side for a total of ten. <coughs> Excuse me. Then you're going to go immediately into push-ups. I'd like to see you guys use the dumbbells for your push-ups to help you get a deficit, increase that range of motion. Uh, let's, let's, the the push-ups aren't ridiculous, so let's, at least on your 10, your 20, uh, let's try to make them as beautiful and perfect as can be, all right? And then we're going to do sit-ups. Uh, you just lay down and do your basic sit-up. Uh, if you're doing the sit-ups in tomorrow's games, we are requiring that you grab a hold of your shoulders, cross your chest, and you're going to come up with your, and touch your elbows to your knees, all right? We're not gonna be able to do the flangers, okay? Uh, after you've done your three rounds over here, like I said, you get your burpee, two box jumps for 25. Find the appropriate box, drop down, chest to the ground, explode, and then jump. Let's make sure that we got our legs underneath us before we make that jump, uh, and avoid some shin scars. Then, whenever we jump back up here, we got hammer curls. There's a little E out to the side, so it's going to be each arm. So your first round is going to be 60 total, 30 each arm. Making sure that we're still going all the way down, all the way up. I still see a lot of people stop it right here, all right? If you have any inkling in your mind that you are not doing this correctly, we got mirrors over there. I, I know a lot of people don't like to look at themselves in the mirror, uh, especially when they're working out. I want that arm straight. And then I don't want that weight to pass the plane to the body. So we're just because I said straight, you're like, come on, straight. Yeah. You get to swing it back here. All the way down, all the way up. Skull crushers. I think you can do these with a set of dumbbells. Uh, you're going to have them just like that. You're going to go to the sides of your head, hinging at the elbows only, and pressing up, squeezing those triceps when you get to the top. Pop up for lateral raises. I like to see you do them kneeling with one knee down. Uh, it, that's going to help you uh, stay uh, good on that form. <laughs> Leading with those elbows straight out to the side. And then we've got half burpees. All the way out, all the way in. This is where you're going to start. You're essentially in a plank position, palm plank position, and you're bringing those knees into your chest, and you're pretty much sitting on your heels at the top of this movement. All right, show them the bad news. Yeah, that's not it. All right. Uh, that's all I got. Any questions? <laughs>